we're going to try to do a few contracts. Um, we're going to try to get some field work done. And uh, all of it is going down to the animal dealer. So today is trying to get three contracts done. Now, this first field right here, I've already cut it. And then I sent an AI worker down to the next field. So I'm coming in here with my other piece of equipment. And we are going to tether this one real quick. Then we're going to make bells. And once we have that made, we will then get on to the next two fields. So let's get this first one done real quick. This one is a pain in the butt and it's really close to home and it's paying out pretty good, but wow, man, what a, what a pain, what a pain. in the mirror so foggy but i've never seen clearer i don't really think anyone can save me and honestly i'm not really sure i want saving i like to be my own worst enemy there's no risk if you don't try it anything so i'ma just get by in everything see you in the next life have to be a better me i don't think that my head's on straight gotta flip it and grip it and go and get an x-ray what's wrong with me i just feel way pushing on my chest and it squeeze till i suffocate better change my mindset meditate it's pretty cool that i'm alive and have better days i could walk see here i should celebrate think i could change my mind maybe yeah Living life every day, late at night, not okay. All I want, and I pray, all I need was a day. All right, there we go. First little field is bailed. Oh, it looks like our AI worker is stuck, hung up in the trees. Well, he did a pretty good job, though. Got hung up good. Split those trees. So we can get out of here. There we go. Let's go ahead and finish this real quick. Pretty good job indeed. I like it. Have to figure out what happened with that crash and see if I can fix that. Headlands look really good, so it must be a middle portion of the course that I'm going to have to fix. So I did over here in this little spot. Well, yeah, just the limitations in the equipment making the gap there. Not bad at all. Right, that field is cut. Let's get him on down to the next one. We'll get him started down there and then we'll come back. All right, let's get a course set up for this one real quick. Uh, we need to save this one. That was field 33. All right, we're gonna clear that course. All right, now we're gonna start with a new course here. We are gonna do our target field, which is this field here. Beautiful. Let's start our course generation. Let's see here. We wanna go a little smaller than our current width. One tool, headlands, let's see here. Let's do two headlands, smooth up and down there's no 
no island here, so we can bypass the island. See what that looks like. Yeah, that looks pretty good. In around. Yeah, there's nothing wrong with that. Okay. Let's go ahead and get this one visible so we can see it. There we go. Looks good. Let's get him started. And there he goes. Okay, that is the last of it. Awesome. Right, there we go, field number three is cut. Okay, there we go. Field is tethered. All right, there we go, bailing is done. Let's go get us a tractor and a trailer and let's come back and pick this stuff up. That's the other thing I love about my new baler. Uh, not only does it have a wide swath, but it really packs on the weight when it comes to making these 180 centimeter bales. Don't have to make a whole lot of them, and man, it just adds up really quick. So I can do three contracts and move, you know, eight, 10 bells at most, especially with these big fields like this. And uh, that's it. Don't have to worry about grabbing a whole bunch of bells and making a lot of trips. It is really, really nice. That looks like it. Let's take these down to the animal dealer. We've got five bells and three contracts. Let's see if we can get them all done. Let's push them off. Contract, contract, contract. Boom, baby. And we made 10,000 in bells. All right, let's look at the contracts. Complete, complete, complete. Collect, collect, collect. All right, before we do any contracts, let's check on the animals and everything real quick. Let's see here. Let's look in our panel. Uh, let's see here. So the well sheep could use some food. The Those sheep look fine. Chickens could use some food. Let's see here. These calves could use some TMR. Oh, yeah. Let's get them some TMR. And the pigs could use some base food. All right. Um, well, we got rid of the little tractor, so I got rid of the little chip. And now our little tractor is actually the Volterra. So this is our little tractor now, Volterra. Excellent. Let's take a look at the calves. TMR. So let's see here. Total capacity is 55. So we could bring in some more TMR. Let's make one more TMR run. All right. 11,000. Excellent. We could bring in some more grass for them as well. That looks good. There we go. Okay. 
I'm oh, so worried about screwing it up. <laughs> All right. That looks pretty good. We're almost at capacity. Uh, let's see. We, if we had some grain, we could throw a little grain in there. A little protein. Grain would be best. What do we need for that? We need some wheat. Let's see if we got any wheat. All right. We at uh, 1984. Went to 3,000 and we maxed out our capacity. All right, let's go over here and give the chickens the rest of the bit. There we go. See what the chickens look like. Nice, almost completely full. That was a great haul right there. All right, what else do we need? I think one of them needed the Welsh. The Welsh needed some beautiful looking grass so I think in our new production we actually have some grass I don't recall but I think we do and if not we'll just grab a couple of bales Yeah, grass. I thought we had some grass. Let's grab that. Oh, no. <laughs> Stop. Oh, my goodness. I just screwed it up. Dump grass everywhere. Let's try this again. Oh my goodness, look at the mess I made. Can't believe I just made that mess. Well, it looks like I'm gonna have to come back with the bucket and fix that. <laughs> All right, there you go, Sam. All cleaned up. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, it just seems like after a year, you think I'd have this all down by now. But no, I just keep screwing it up more and more every day. But it's all right. It's all right. It's all right. I'm loving it. I'm enjoying it. All right, brother. I hope you're doing well. Hit me back when you get a chance. Talk to you soon. Probably talk to you in July. <laughs> See you, man. Take care.